Hey guys, sorry about that. I just got a new phone and I guess I didn't have as much storage on there as I thought I did, so I gotta continue this on my laptop. But in the future, I'll either use my laptop or I'll get some storage space for my phone so I can do it that way. So no worries, this won't be happening again. But um, so where were we? So you, do you know, the collective energy I've been getting is that you have more than one potential life partner. That's not just for Sagittarius viewers, that's for most of the people that are drawn to this channel. Most of the people that um, subscribe to me that I, I've been channeling, that's kind of the, the collective story I've been telling. Um, is It's what I've been feeling for you guys is is that you, you do have more than one potential life partner coming in. You're going to have options. And it's really up to you if you want to stay in that cycle with this person from the past. You know, there is a history here. There is nostalgia here, I think, on both ends. So it's understandable. But, you know, you do also have somebody new that's just come in or somebody new that's going to be coming in that's you know, could be more better suited for you, could be somebody that's more willing to match your energy. But, um, but yeah, what I was getting with this person is it's like there is this hidden truth and they wanted to take the mask off with you, but they just couldn't. And now they're thinking about coming forward, you know, with this open, honest communication, this message, but they're not sure about it now because I think, I think they just feel like they missed the opportunity. Maybe you guys haven't talked in a while, or maybe you do talk, but it's like small talk and it's like the moment just isn't right anymore. Like maybe you talk, but it's more casual and not as deep as it was before. There's just some kind of energy here where it's like, they just feel like, like it's a missed opportunity. Like they wanted, I think that they were dreaming about you and thinking about you so much that they kind of assumed that you could just feel that energy. Like they thought that you just knew what they felt because they were in their head so much about it, but you didn't really know how strong their feelings actually were. You know, they wanted to be forward about why they were cold, guarded, distrusting. And again, I think they were planning some stuff behind the scenes. I think that they were they they were kind of trying to figure out how to make this bold gesture, how to get past their fear. You know, this is choosing love over fear. This is risk reward. But again, I think that they you guys had such a psychic connection, maybe showing up in each other's dreams, maybe like a telepathic connection, and uh, especially with this this moon energy we have right now. And I think that they kind of ignored that. They tried to focus on their finances and career and put that on the back burner. I think that the spiritual world maybe scared them a little bit or maybe they just it wasn't familiar to them. Maybe they've never had that kind of psychic connection with somebody and so they just weren't sure what to how to react to that. Um, but they're wanting to tell you that, that they feel at home with you, that you're their safe space. They've been wanting to tell you that it is a potential life partner. I think in the past it's been like a chase or chasey game. It's like you guys are always just not on the same page. There's a power struggle. But they're trying to be assertive and forward and um, you know they're motivating themselves to, to make this move and come forward and talk to you. But again, where are my other cards? Again, you do have somebody else too that you do have two potential life partners, I feel. So let's see what else we get. Yeah, see, so you have the option of ending this pattern, this cycle, um, and having this breakthrough, you know? Maybe I think it's like a power struggle. It's been a power struggle with this person where somebody always wants to have the upper hand. Somebody always wants to be like dominant or in control. You know what I mean? It's like you guys both kind of hold held on to your pride. But again, I do see an apology and some kind of regret coming in here. But show me the new person though, because what's going on with the new person? See, so yeah, pause, reflection, rest, and then taking it slow, pulling them in and getting to know each other. Beauty, mystery, enchantment. Hmm. See, this is somebody, this is like a, someone who's kind of seduced by you, somebody who might be watching you from afar, planning their move. You might have a couple people actually kind of just watching you right now and um, wanting to make a move. You've got mental instability here with a honeymoon adventure vacation, so I kind of take that as like a need for rest. Maybe everything is just piled up too much, too much stress. You know, you're needing a vacation and this person might kind of be your escape too. They might be able to offer that. Maybe they would go on a vacation with you. You guys might travel together. Um, we've got the X holding on there. Yeah, but choose a path. <laughs> you've got the person that's fear of, afraid of commitment and then you've got...
I think it's saying you guys can reconcile, but they might not have actually worked through their commitment issues. There might be, it might, like, maybe you can reconcile, but they're probably still going to have some stuff to work on. Um... I do feel they've grown up, but I don't think they've grown up as much as they need to grow up. You know what I mean? Like, they've done some work, but it's not quite enough. Um, and with this new person that's either just come in or coming in, it's like you can also have the same telepathic deep connection with this person. And you can have this new start, this adventure, this honeymoon, this, like, vacation with this person. Um, it's just new energy. So, the, you know, the choice is really yours. Uh, it might be coming in fast too. So thank you guys for watching. And if it resonates, go ahead and subscribe.